Good evening and welcome to season two finale of In the Pan with Joe and Diane. Right, here we go. This is it. Um, we've it didn't take long. We are already on to the uh, the episode where we could get potentially quite quite merry, quite loose. Look around I you. see. I'm looking around me. I see absolute <laughs> vodka. I see tequila. I see chocolate liqueur. Yeah. I see Bailey's. I see, what's that one? Do you know what? I don't know. It's called Cooper. Yeah. Now, if you're under 21 in America, or if you're under 18 in the UK... Make mocktails. Mocktails is the way forward. If you're over that age, then this is the episode for you, because we're about to create some of the most interesting cocktails that we found on the internet. Okay, right. So we are, we are surrounded by ingredients. Yes, we um, really are. We have a list of different cocktails to make. Shall, where should we start? I've chose some, Joe's chose some. Yeah. We're gonna start with the one I chose. Let's start with the one that you chose first. I chose the Cookie Monster. The cookie Monster How, cocktail. Okay, so I'm guessing so we need this In this here. one, Joseph, we need cake vodka. We don't have that. Okay, we have we vanilla, vanilla flavoured. That's We the have same. vanilla. Say That's vanilla the, cake. The, the best we could do. Vanilla cake. We need white chocolate liqueur. We don't have that. We have chocolate liqueur. Okay, this is going well. But that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Two cups of vanilla ice cream. Oh, we do have that in the free in the fridge. Yes. Okay, good. Got do you that. want to get that out? What now? Yeah. But it will melt. Just tell me when we need it and I'll get it out. The thing is, well, my freezer's broken still. It's I've got some come out to repair it, but we, I just leave it in there until the last minute, then we get it out because it'll go soft. Whoa, do you want to tell me where your fridge is from as well? What's just there? No, like, where did you buy it? Oh, uh, What make is your fridge? You went into so much detail I can't, for that I, story. I always thought it was, um, Miele, but it's not. It's, I'm joking It's like German, fridge. like, Kupperspusch. <laughs> oh, wow, it is really... Kupperspusch. What is the two little eyes under the, over the top of the Means U. Oh. Okay, I didn't really mean that. Kupperspusch. We need Oreo cookies. Yes. What was that beat? That was me oh, turning turn the oven on. on. We do not need the oven in this episode. That's basically everything. We kind of need the ice cream now anyway, but oh well. Really? Okay, right. So. Oh, glass. What sort of glass so do you want? So what we're going to do is we're going to use the blend tech and we're going to basically blend all our ingredients together. I'm so excited but for this But I've got one. one of these. No, you can, Oh, Joe, you need the blender for this. <laughs> we need to blend the ice cream. So would you like to get me the ice cream now? Oh, yeah. Now is the time. Thanks. That whole 20 seconds makes So you didn't such actually need like solid ice cream. So in a blender, we need to blend the ice cream. Then we're going to put two cups of vanilla ice cream. Ooh. Careful, ice careful, cream. careful, careful, careful. Ice cream, you scream. Okay, no, we've done it, we've done it, we've done it. Ice cream, you, you scream. scream. We all scream for ice cream. Thank I know you. that rhyme. We never used to say that when we were as a kid, though. That was never a thing in where I grew up. No? No, we just said, oh, do you want an ice cream? Yeah, all right. Get me a 99. Get me a. How much is it? Right, so two cups. How are we going to measure that, Joe? With a cup, probably. Do you want to get me a cup? Yes. Oh, that looks so good. Mm. Can you not? Can you not try. put it in your mouth and mm. then put it in there? Mm. Whoa, Producer you... Josh has got to try this. Yeah, he does. Oh my god! Don't ruin my my Le Creuset mugs, <laughs> which were love, which were very kindly gifted to me as of recent, along with a lot of other Le Creuset. Let's items. say that's one cup. Okay, in the blender. Mhm. Mm mm. Oh, good. There you go. Oh, it's like a dump. <laughs> mm. You're quick at this. Yeah, because I'm quick. If it was you, you'd be like... Is that enough, do you reckon? That'd be fine. Oh my god, this is painful. No. How annoying is it? I wouldn't do it that slow. You would. Isn't it annoying? See? I enjoy my craft. Two cups. You can't rush art. Now, we want to put two of the Oreo cookies in there. Two Oreo cookies into the blender. So I hate Bold. the idea of mixing sweet stuff with alcohol. Like, that's not something that I would enjoy. So we're going to blend... The ice cream and the Oreo cookie. Oh, no. Pulse, pulse. Smoothie, smoothie. No, don't be too long! What? No! Whoa! Ah! Oh, sh! I forgot the liqueurs. Oh, obviously, the key ingredient. No, just, wait, 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 just pour it in like this. Take oh. this off. And you pour it. Oh, there you go. You pour it in from the top. Oh my god, I forgot the liqueurs. What's an ounce as well? What is oh. an ounce? Got ya. Ounce, ounce, an ounce, ounce, is ounce, this. ounce, ounce, ounce. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's an ounce and that's a double. So we need one ounce, ounce of vanilla vodka. Boom. It also says one ounce of cake vodka. So it actually says to put cake 
and vanilla vodka. So but, what you're gonna do is put two ounces, because you add the two together, of vanilla vodka. Okay, but... Two ounces in of vanilla vodka. But to be fair, as well, who is buying cake vodka? Where do you get cake vodka from? I don't from? know, I've never heard of it before. No, neither have anyway, I. Right, we're put, that's it. We've put two ounces of vanilla vodka in. One ounce of white chocolate liqueur. We don't have white chocolate liqueur, we have chocolate liqueur, that's which we'd fine. have to do. There we go. Da, 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 ba, ba. Ba, 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 ba. Here comes a copyright strike. <laughs> Bye. There you go. Chocolate liqueur is in. This looks gross at the moment. Like that genuinely looks grim. Now let's continue. Ooh, that smells good though. Does it? Let's continue pulsating. <laughs> All right. Now we need to put it into a cup. Get the cup out, Joe. This is so exciting. Okay, we're pouring this into a glass. That genuinely looks like gruel. It looks good. Please, sir. Can I have some more? <gasps> <gasps> Look at that. A musical theatre so now, that's why. One, that's, okay, so now what we're going to do is we've got to get our frosting for the top. So we have um, just bought this frosting. Yeah, we, ha we, we didn't find the right frosting. But because it's Cookie Monster, we need to turn it blue. So Joe, can you get me some food, blue, blue food colouring? Blue food colouring. I hope we have some. Now we need, yeah, we need a piping bag, Joe. I'll pipe your bag in a minute. <laughs> what piping nozzle do you want? Oh my god. What piping nozzle do you that want? That is good, Joe. Can I try? Yeah, that will. Send you west. No, see, I couldn't do that. Really? Something about like alcohol in puddings it needs yeah. to be way more blue, Diane. I the know. cookie monster's a blue old fella. I know. Why am I being so careful? Yeah, you're never normally this carefree. No. Is it because now you you live with me? Now you actually treasure my belongings? Um, yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's why. <laughs> yeah. Which nozzle do you want? Um, nozzle, schmozzle, or the that one, please. Okay. Right, so guys, what we've done oh, is was... this is icing and I've just put some blue food coloring in it to make it look like Cookie Monster because we're going to pipe on the top. Quick, Joe! Yeah, I'm trying, trying to get it through. I had three jobs to do, you had one and you're still <laughs> yeah, doing wait. it. Yeah, <laughs> wait. You're gonna do this musical and the, the musical will be finished and you'll still be singing. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Can I put this ice cream back in the fridge yet? Because it looks like Yes, you may. I can let you do that. See you in an hour. I'm just so chill. It's because I used to live with Byron. And when I lived with Byron, we didn't do anything with speed. Like, if Byron watched this right now, he he'd be like, like Whoa, bro, slow down. I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> on the top of this. You'd think he's watching it in fast forward. That looks awful. What is that? I don't understand. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, how much frosting do we have? <laughs> Oh no! I think it's meant to be. Lay it over the side. It's got to go over the side. Look at the picture, Diane. Use the picture for reference. No, it's got to go You've completely messed that up. Lay it on the back. It's all going to sink. It's more dense. Did you not learn anything in science? Pop it on the side of the rim. That's it. And then you can build it up off the back of the. <laughs> Joe, this needs to be thicker. What, the milkshake? Yeah. How do you do that? Put sand in it. That looks awful. It looks like you, somebody just had your toothpaste exploded into, the, into your gruel. Right, yep. we need two eyes, Joe. We need two eyes. With what? Oh, here. Oh, for... I'm slow and heavy-handed. Oh. You call that shy? No, wait. No, you... No, you're... Cheating, oh, that's not going to stay. Do you not understand how gravity works? Just let it go, it's over. There's no, there's no bringing that back from the dead. Oh, wait. <laughs> Is that it? Yeah. That's it, then? That's it. Ta-da! Ta-da! There we go. Okay, you ready for this? Any good? Mmm. Yeah? It's very yummy. Very alcoholy. You just ate the cookie monster. <laughs> no, look at him. He's drowning. I love it. It's actually not bad, but it's like, for me, it's like an alcoholic milkshake, and I hate the thought of like an alcoholic milkshake. Producer Josh, you want to try it? I'll give it a crack. It's like a really sad scene from like a Muppets type Sesame Street meets Titanic, that is. I don't mind it. I would give that a I would give it a 6.5 out of 10 pans. Glasses. I would give it a a beatbox. Less seven. Seven out of seven. Okay, seven. so we basically get the same score. Seven glasses. That's confusing. Also, if you want to check out any of these recipes um, down below, we found them on Pinterest. We will link every single one down in the description. We take no credit from this. We're just copying other people's greatness. This cocktail we're making right hey, now. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, we got my nan. I mean, nan used to do that with a hanky. Get out, that's disgusting. You've got chocolate on you. Yeah, but you don't need to lick your finger then, but just, just tell me and I'll get rid of it myself. Anyway, what do you know about alien brain hemorrhages? 
quite a lot actually, I did a study <laughs> on it at school. I think I wouldn't even put it past you. <laughs> Next cocktail we're making is an alien brain hemorrhage. Now for this, I found this on Pinterest, it looks insane, right? Right. I'm not going to tell you how it's made. This drink defies the laws of physics. Do you need a Bunsen burner? Uh, I don't, but at some point we will need a blowtorch. This is one that you, I guess you would sip on or maybe not even drink at all. Like, I think it's just one for show. No, you drink, drink it. I think if you drank this though, you'd probably end up dead. That is well strong. Three quarters of the glass needs to be. Yeah, but peach snaps isn't strong. Is it not? Okay, so we've got our peach snaps in there like that. Now, next up, Diane, trust me on this. We need a pourer. You slot it in like this. Watch this. Are you ready for this? Oh my god, yeah. This is going to be fun. Look what happens when you pour the Baileys into the peach snaps. Oh, it's like a brain hemorrhage. It's like a brain, isn't it? Boom. Oh. So you've got that in there. That looks like sick. I remember when my mum threw up once on oh holiday in, in the Algarve from Calamari and it looks just like this. Sorry, mum. Whoa, Whoa, you put a lot in. Yeah. But it all rises to the top. That's a bit weird. It's not supposed to do that. That looks... Disgusting. Is that all you do? It looks like tuna on top. Blue coro coro This. Yeah. What's it called? Crocrea. Blue. Corocrea. Blue Corioca. A splash of it. Ooh! That nice. smells good. Oh. It's something you find in Lush. Then a little splash of blue Corioca. Ready? Going yeah. in now. That's more than a splash. That's fine. Look. You just want to give it a little bit of a. Okay. more than a splash. Yeah, it's a, it's a cool splash. Look at that. Grenadine syrup is the last one. Oh. A splash of grenadine, like that, like so. Look, and oh. then look, it starts to do that. Oh, look. Let's do another one, see what happens. Oh, it's breaking. It breaks it up, look. Look at that. So when you pour the grenadine in, it makes it go all like crazy like that. Who needs TV or YouTube when you can just look at this all day? That's cool. It's interesting, isn't it? Yeah. Do you want to give it a go? Um, Do you want to try it? Yeah. We kind of have to try it. It is cool though. We should make them for your party. Yeah. I think no one will touch it. I think someone put, who put like mixed no. up chicken in there? Yeah, okay, really? It does look like chicken, doesn't it? Right. Ladies first. Diane, do the honors. This is a alien brain hemorrhage. You like Bailey's as well. It's made a change language. <laughs> <laughs> Turns out it's actually a drink of her like homeland or where the planet she's from. Oh, Very nice. It's like ASMR. You don't like the feeling of the top, do you? Yeah. Blah, blah. And it's the, the, the texture of the Baileys is like, it, I'm thinking about sick too much. So it's like. It's quite nice though, isn't it? Mm -mm. It's not, it's too strong and too like. Really? You can, you can, you Producer can sip Josh, it. give that a go. You could sip it and you could do it as a shot maybe, but you could not drink that slow. I'm going to give that a four out of 10. I'm going to give it a five out of 10. Five? Yeah. Okay, fair enough. This one is a dedication to my mum and dad. Are you going to sing or what? Because it's oh. called, it's an apple margarita. Ah, see so what you did there. That's, so, that's, that's almost too clever for you. Is it? I feel like that's one of the producers. What are you doing? You cut it in half. No, think about it. Cut what? apples in half and hollow out. Yeah, but it makes more sense to cut just the top off and then the hollow it out because then you've got more of a cup. You cut it in half, you lose half your volume. No? Mm, all right. Nice. See? Right. No, whoa, 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 whoa. Hollow, whoa. hollow. Oh my god, you're going to cut your finger off. You are generally going to cut your finger off. We have a tool for that, probably. No, we don't. We must do. Just use a, oh, <laughs> use a spoon. Can I just borrow that quickly so I can start mine? Yeah. You're hollowing out your apple, which is a very strange Sensibly. thing to do. Sensibly. I've never done that before. How this one we'll have to do for your birthday party too, Joe. Yeah. Wait, who says I'm having a birthday party? I don't know. Maybe so, it's a surprise. Which I don't think you'd be capable of doing that, you know. <laughs> I genuinely don't think you've got the minerals. <laughs> What does that mean? You don't, you don't got what it takes. Hey, that's really cool. I've never realised that at the bottom of an apple there's actually a star. Or is that just fancy? You see? Oh yeah! See? Fun fact for you all. In the pan is very educational at the moment. Very educational. Also guys, we obviously need to put this message out because we are drinking in this video and doing a video based around alcoholic drinks. Drink responsibly. You know, make you can make these drinks at home without using alcohol. But I've got an issue. What? As a hole at the bottom of my apple. Oh, no. So what I'm putting there is going to leak. That's right. not good at all. That's all right. Look, mine's good. This is mine's like, good. Mine's hollow. It's like a supermarket. Once again, we're waiting for Joe. This is, like, this, is like, this is like a supermarket basic version of pumpkin carving. Here hey, go, how about less talking, more carving?
Yeah, I'm trying. I just got... Have you got deodorant on? Yeah. <laughs> Why do I stink? Yeah. Really? Yeah, you got. I just sprayed. You got stinky pits. No, I just sprayed. See, you can smell it. Okay, yeah, I have got stinky pits, but I've tried to cover them. I made the effort. That's what counts. Hmm. In a cocktail shaker. Oh, here's your cocktail shaker. Yes. Really. How about you get that and I'll finish that? No, no, no. I'm doing oh. it. You get the cocktail shaker. Right. Cocktail shaker. In our cocktail shaker, we add two measures of canoe and two <laughs> measures of tequila. Yeah, you do that. She means contro. That. Two measures? What would two measures be? Ah, that's like... Two of those, or one of these. Okay, two of the contra. So, one of this. Boom. Also add two tequila. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here we go, here's the tequila. Oh, I love the sombrero. <laughs> that is cool. That looks like a really dodgy tequila. Cool, it matches your hair. Yeah. Blends, that's so cool. How am I going to plug my hole? That's my main issue. Huh. I've made a great little hot tub, apple hot tub, but how am I going to plug my hole? Two of tequila. Do we need ice in there? What? <laughs> this... <laughs> what? The smell of tequila makes me shiver. Does it get, get you? Yeah. The smell? No, I like that. Do you know what? I can, I can do tequila. That's the only one I can do. Oh my god, just steady. Look, no, you don't use... I'm like Pirates of the Caribbean. It's like she's using the Bowie, Bowie knife on bloody... So, the juice of two limes. I learnt this on... What's that show we went on? Sunday Brunch. Sunday Brunch. Put your fingers there to catch the pips. There's no... <laughs> There's no pips in limes. Is there not? <laughs> I mean, no, carry on, catch those pips. <laughs> There's pips in lemons, but not I'm in limes. I'm so excited about the fact. <laughs> you were, weren't you? Damn it! You think you're a right little boffin. <laughs> Is it only lemons? Yeah, look. You Whatever. Try to find a pip in there. Whatever, lemon. So the juice of two limes. It's so funny if I squeeze it and just go. These are pipless limes, so oh we don't God, need to do that. Oh my God, watch your fingers. Look, doesn't that look like a little sea creature you find oh in the bottom God, of the ocean? It does. We could put that in that. Like a little trilobite. Put it in the hemorrhage drink, it'll fit in yeah. nicely. Cool, what's this lid for? Okay, why why have you why have you done that? What? That wasn't me. Get that out now. That wasn't please. me. Okay, yeah, I'll take it out there. All of it. What? Take it all to the bit. That's Do not mine! That's not mine! <laughs> we need to add grenadine for colour. Yep, the red one. I'm I'm still trying to figure out how I'm gonna plug my hole. I'm gonna use the apple sticker, maybe. Bit of red grenadine I, in there. And a little bit of ice. Can we get some ice, please, Joe? Yes. Go, in. Yes, okay. Now, glass goes on. No, no, Ca careful, careful. You're not doing it right, you're not doing it right. Stop. Why? You've got to make sure it's wedged in. It's wedged in. Look, you're doing it, look, pass it here. Because look, this is where it all goes horribly wrong. Come here. Come here, I'll towel whip you. Let me have, let me have a go. No. Right, I'm going to towel it for you. Cold. Oh, it's cold. Ow! <laughs> you went for the knife! <laughs> you went for the knife! Jeez. Remind me never to ever do that ever again. Yeah, don't worry. Right, so you make sure it's on like this. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Um, and then which way up is it? Like that way? <laughs> ah! That's not even how you do it. Yeah, it is. All right, that's enough. That's so cold on my I hands. I know, it's cold, isn't it? Then you go. Now these are our cups. Like that. So you take it like this, you clip it over, so it's like that, you just hold it like that, and then you just pour. And then, like so. Oh, cute. You've got your little apple cocktail look. Oh, you, I reckon it would look cute to put like some sugar on the end and stuff. Yeah. It's, you know what, do you know what's kind of annoying about this? The apple goes brown from oxidization. Cheers it. Cheers. Do you know what? Before we drink it, this is the, the answer to sustainability. What does that mean? Well, you know like how everyone's using like um, straws that aren't plastic? Mm. This is, you don't even need a glass. This is saving glass as well. So they've got a, um, a bottle cap coming out of the bottom of mine. Cheers it. Cheers. Oh wow. See that for me is a winner. That is an absolute winner. Uh, <laughs> you can I hate tequila. And you can make, you can bite your way and make a little funnel. Look, you know, so it pours into your mouth easier. You make a little, make a little mouth groove. Mm, actually, with the apple, it's really nice. Yeah, I think if you let it marinate there for a bit, it'd be really tasty. That's extremely strong. But that, for me, that's one of the best ones. 
by far. Uh, for creativity, I give it like seven, but for taste, I give it three. Overall score, you have to give an overall score. Okay. Take it into account. Come on, do you use that brain. Nine. <laughs> I'm so confused. You're giving that a nine out of 10? Yeah, well I added seven and three. Yeah, that's, that's, that's not how it works. No, it's seven and two. You would deduct points from it though. No, I added. This is, this is not worth nine. me explaining. Nine. I'm gonna give it an eight. Mm -hmm. That's a lot. <laughs> what? You give it a nine? Yeah. I gave it an eight. Because I added two numbers together. Oh, right. Do you know what? Have another one. Right, now listen. Yeah. Before we make this one, yeah. me and producer Josh had a conversation and said that you are not allowed to use the uh, blowtorch. Uh, sorry, what? We've decided, we made a mutual, you are outnumbered. You I, have, here. I have my Bun Bunsen burner license. You weren't here when we agreed. I you have my Bunsen so burner license. You were license. late. Not only were you late to filming, but also you were outnumbered and we decided that- you... Do you have your Bunsen burner license? Uh, no, but we don't, we, what I'm trying to say is, you're not allowed to use the Bunsen, but uh, the- yeah. oh, Look what you made me do. <laughs> right, next up, we are making a schmortini, which uh, consists of marshmallow fluff, uh, digestive biscuits. You're meant to use graham crackers, but I didn't have a clue. Why is a graham cracker? Graham crackers, we didn't have that in the UK, which is what you usually put um, schmorge on. So we have this, you're gonna crumble up And what you're gonna do biscuit. is you're gonna put your fluff onto a plate. You're, your a good, you're a good fluffer, Diane. I know. And then what you need to do. You're a really good fluffer. Did anyone tell you that? Is put it in the microwave with one tablespoon of water for 20 seconds. Eat it. No, I'm not gonna eat that. Come on. I don't know where your finger's been. Just eat it. Up my bum. <laughs> <laughs> you're 30. <laughs> You're actually 30. I know. Perfect. Diane, next up, next move, please. We're going to take, right, what we're going to do next is we're going to take our glass like this. We're going to dip the glass in the schmores like so. So you get like that. Oh, you get yes. like that. That's so cool. Like that. Can I do it? No, no, just look, just calm down. Look, see now what you're doing. No, you need to do more. You dip your rim in the fluff. Make sure you're watching this, guys, and not just listening to this, because you're going to be freaked out. Now you've got your rim going, you're going to take this, like so. Yeah, I'll do this And dip one. it into the, yeah, dip it in the crumbs. Got it. Get it covered in crumbs. Oh, Jake, That's this it. is so cool. This is a clever one, We should it? make this for your birthday party. Yeah. Surprise one I don't know about. Yeah. Right, now we're going to get our chocolate sauce, and we're going to do a swirl inside around the glass. Wait like for this. me! No. I can't see. Oh, <gasps> yes, that's amazing. Now we decorate the inside of our glass. This is looking good. Let's not cock this up. Six ozzers of chocolate liquor. Six ounces of chocolate liqueur. One, two, four, three. Don't try and do this to me. Six. Four, five, six. Okay, that looks like doo doo water. And then three of the three vanilla. Three of the vanilla vodka. Wait, three ounces? So yep. that's, okay, so that's just one, two. Don't burp at me. I'm trying to concentrate. Three. And okay. ice. And that's it. And ice. All yeah. it took was vodka chocolate liqueur and ice i'm gonna sh i'm gonna show what if they can't drink alcohol what would they put you could put i would put i would uh, blend nesquik. nesquik yeah nesquik together you get some nesquik in there and you just have some, you just have fun with it you know whilst i'm doing this i need to find these those sticks Okay. That's so cold on my hand. It's freezing that thing, yeah. isn't it? It's stuck. You stocked it. It's stuck. No, the, <laughs> it's the way of doing it. See, I should. <laughs> I see a dry hand. That's all I need. No, don't you do it. Okay. <laughs> you're, don't you'll hurt yourself. Right. Don't break the glass. <sighs> what if you break the glass and, you, and you cut your um, Tendons. veins? There's a way you've got to bash it. No, turn it around. Ah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you go in the way of my bashing. No, don't do it that way. No, you don't do it that way. Stop. Stop. Heat, we need heat. No, we don't. We just need to... You've just got to karate chop it in the right Ice area. Ice expands. How, we do, how do you do it? Is there a way of doing it? Know. Is it? Yeah. 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 No, no, do you want it? Yeah. <gasps> oh, my God. Whoa. Guys, we... Uh, this is the end of the channel. I can't We're, believe producer Josh used to be a bartender. Josh, Josh has had... You should, he, he's crazy. I need you to snap these so they're long enough just to go just about... Oh, just about to go over the length of this. We're going to pour this in just like so. There we go. Look at that. 
Oh, that looks yummy. That looks, this could be our best one, you I think. You know what, we could have added Baileys. Oh, we could have, couldn't we? Yeah. Two marshmallows oh, across a stick. Two marshmallows across a stick. One pink, one white. Nice. Stick it on. Yeah, put it across. That's it. Perfect. Another fun bit. Get rid of that. Get yep. rid of the sticks. Oh no, it sunk. I know I'm being slow, but slow and steady wins the race. Okay, now, now fun bit. <gasps> Blowtorch. Oh my god. Can I do one and you do the other? Uh, okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Now we're gonna scorch oh. our marshmallows like so. Oh, Look at that. Cool. Yeah, you just keep melting so oh, it goes Joe. slightly burned. Let's make this for your party. Don't stand back. I've got flame. Look at that, smell that. Imagine this at your party. Whoa, oh. Let oh. me do. I put it in the alcohol, that's not a good idea. Good idea. No, because then that could flame. Oh, that's nicely caramelized mine. Get it right. That's it. That's it, change, change, move it. You need to hold it that close. That's it, keep an eye on it. Keep an eye on it. That's it. Good. Very good. No, no, you don't do the same bit again. Oh! Yes. That there we is go. so cool. That mm. is, without doubt, one of the best cocktails. It took me it took four hours to make, but that is your schmortini. Right. Here you go. I'll let you go first. Okay. Try the schmortini. I love the design down the side. Mm. Why do you drink cocktails so weird? Mm. Yeah? Yeah. Do you actually like that? If I made you that randomly, you know, you just got at the bath and I came upstairs with one of these, would you be impressed? Yeah, I would. Oh my God. Strong, isn't it? That is so strong. That's too much for me. See, I'm not a fan. No. Nope. Couldn't do that. No. Nope. It is really strong. Not a fan. Once again, it's like drinking an alcoholic chocolate milkshake. What too you much. Give, what are you giving it? I would give that. It looks amazing, but I would give it, I'd give it a six. Really? I think I'd give it a six. That's, that's, that's quite disappointing me a little bit. I think that's the best one yet. I'm giving it an eight. So good. I like the edge. What, from you too? Hmm? Sorry. Oh, do you know what I haven't tried though? Oh, try that. Yeah. Oh, it oh. sounded so crispy. That redeems it a little bit. Does it? Mm. With the marshmallow, I would give it a seven, but I'm still gonna give it a six. And there you go, there you have it. That was four cocktails that we found on the internet and thought to try and recreate for your entertaining pleasure. Hope you enjoyed do it. Do you feel drunk? Uh, not yet. I feel like when we cut, I'll probably It'll probably kick in. It'll hit you. Hit you like a sandboy chip. Right, there we go. I hope you enjoyed the episode and I hope you enjoyed the series. It's been an amazing one. We've loved it. What was that? I don't know, but cheers. You've just broken my cooker. All for one and one for all. Cheers. Have a drink I... and we'll see you. Cool. <laughs> hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Get excited for the next series and we will see you again very, very soon. But until then. Until then. Um, until then. Make sure you do your homework. And remember, drink responsibly. Drink responsibly. Uh, you can try these as mocktails as well. <laughs> right, we'll see you soon. Cheers, bye.